It's 7.30 in the morning. It sucks. I think, you know, obviously because there's a lot of people here, they just have no perception awareness of how to walk or... It, it's just, it's nuts. So, if you ever come here, you want to avoid rush hour. You really do. And, especially when you're on the train and you're packing like sardines, put up with it. Because um, everybody does. There are no yelling matches, there are no fighting. It's just push in, everybody's got to go to the same place, so they take it as being acceptable. Well, I gotta go take a shoot this one. Well, got through the ticket gate of uh, the Shinkansen and uh, I have to uh, get to track 17. I'm a little early, so I'm gonna go uh, do a little bit of filming of Shinkansens. Why don't I keep looking there instead of here? Hmm. It's amazing how busy it is on a Monday morning just to take a Shinkansen. Shinkansen's right there. Um, I'm not sure exactly what the difference is. Obviously, that one over there says it's a JR700. And uh, this one here, that's closest to me, that's the uh, Nozomi. Uh, there are three types of Shinkansen's that you can take between Tokyo and Nagoya. Um, this train, obviously, it's going all the way down to southern Japan, but. Um, for the three specific types of trains, there's the Kodama, which is basically like the local Shinkansen train. It'll stop off at every station between Tokyo and Nagoya. Then there's the Hikari, which will stop off every third station kind of thing. It's like a semi-express. And then there's the Nozomi, which uh, if you travel between Tokyo and uh, Nagoya, it's going to stop off at uh, Shin Yokohama and then Nagoya, or Shinagawa, Shin Yokohama, and Nagoya. So it takes about an hour and 40 minutes, uh, probably up to, you know, somewhere around a couple hundred kilometers an hour. It's pretty awesome. If you are a smoker, they have a smoking room on the platform. Have a smoke before you get on the train. The other thing I would say is that, uh, oh, there goes the Shinkansen. Like I was saying. The other thing I would say is that uh, sometimes unreserved seats, which I have, uh, it can get really, really busy. There's big lineups. Um, so if you want to guarantee yourself a seat, spend the extra few bucks, get a reserve seat. Oh, well, the Shinkansen is not that busy actually, I'm surprised. Hour and 45 minutes, I'll be in Nagoya. So usually, um, the non-reserved seats are cars 1 to 3. Um, even though there's no smoking on the train, they do have uh, smoking rooms. Uh, there's a smoking room between cars 3 and 4, 7 and 8, and car 10 or something. Um, from 4 to 16 or 10 or whatever, um, those are all reserved seats and they got green car seats. Freaking sitting in a palace seat for, but you pay a lot of money for that. Um, I'm sitting in car two and uh, just waiting to take off. Speed so much. 
once we uh, pass Shin, uh, Shin Yokohama, we'll be up to a couple hundred kilometers an hour. And they actually do have instructions uh, in Japanese and in English, which I'm waiting for. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the Shinkansen. This is the Nozomi Super Express bound for Hiroshima. We will be stopping at Shin Yokohama, Nagoya, Kyoto, Shin Osaka, Shin Kobe, and Okayama stations before arriving at Hiroshima Terminal. Cars 1, 2, and 3 are for passengers without seat reservations. Alright, so we left Tokyo at 8.40. Just leaving uh, Shin Yokohama, 9 o'clock. Only 20 minutes. Next stop, Nagoya. Oh yeah, and if you want a view of Mount Fuji, sit on the right side of the Shinkansen going towards Nagoya. Probably won't see it today though, it's cloudy. Tokyo, it was cold. I got my winter long business winter jacket on, and it's still, you know, a little cool, but it's sunny here at least. It's pretty awesome. I haven't been here for a couple of years. A lot of things have changed actually. Um, but yeah, this is kind of outside of the station here. The Shinkansen was uh, up, that, up over there. And looking at a highway bus there, this area, if you do come to Nagoya, um, whether you're coming from Tokyo or going to Tokyo on this side of the station here is where all the night buses and highway buses are so hope that's some useful information at least anyways and I think the bus actually takes about five to seven hours depends on which bus you get Shinkansen much faster So, um, 
uh, Nagoya Station, there are clocks, which are uh, basically meeting points. Um, there's a silver clock where I came out of, and I'm just at the other end of the station to get the, uh, the subway. And uh, here, this end is the gold clock. It's right by the Takeshimaya department store. So if anybody ever asks you, meet at the gold clock, that's the gold clock. On the other side of the station now, uh, just about to go into the subway, but I'm looking for a smoking area. This is how boring this side of the station is. That looks pretty cool. And I like that building, I remember that. If you uh, do come to Nagoya or something like that, um, your Suica card, if you have one, will actually still work here. It works throughout the whole country. Um, I think they use like Manaka in this region, but Suica is fine, or uh, the one from Osaka, Fukuoka, or whatever. But uh, yeah, just down the subway, looking to get the train. Of course, there's the train, which I'll miss. Something interesting is uh, this here, car 13. It's an all-day, women-only car. Whereas in Tokyo, um, you know, you might have the last car or the first car up until 9 a.m., women-only. But here they have a women-only, right here, right here all day. So that's pretty good. Hey, right, well, I made it out to Hongo Station from the subway. The Vie de France is still here. I actually used to live in this area probably about eight years ago um, when I worked at head office for my company for a while. Um, not much has changed. Even uh, lining up for the buses is still the same. You can see over there the bus is coming. So yeah, I'm gonna go uh, look for a cafe. I'm a little early, a couple hours early, but I'm always early, so. Just gotta go look to have a smoke. I couldn't find a place to smoke in Nagoya Station, so. But yeah, this is kind of uh, nostalgic to be back in Nagoya. I've always liked Nagoya. It's a nice little uh, city. Uh, well, I shouldn't say little city, but it's still nice. Um, but yeah, I prefer Tokyo anyways. Well, now it's a long walk to the uh, meeting area oh yeah I have my not mine it's a polka dot suitcase that's how brave I am <laughs> all right well after walking up this slightly slope of a hill I'm tired because I'm fat, but I'm about to go into my meeting. We'll see you tonight when we all go drinking. Thank you very much for watching. If you'd like to subscribe, hit that subscribe button. If you'd like to donate to the Tokyo Drew community, hit on that Patreon button. And if you'd like to keep on the channel and see my other videos, there's two choices there for you. Thanks again for watching. Keep it real, y'all.